Hello students, today I am going to discuss hypergeometric distribution, recurrence relation for probabilities of hypergeometric distribution. Okay, see here students, you might be knowing this formula, ncr is equal to n factorial by r factorial into n minus r factorial. And you know the se uh, sequence, right? If it is 5 factorial, we will write it as 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. If it is n factorial, we will write it as n, n minus 1, n minus 2, so on, right? So now, let's discuss the hypergeometric uh, hyper distribution recurrence relation for probabilities. Okay, now students, we, we know the formula of recurrence relation. In my previous video, video also, I have discussed uh, what is the formula. Just have a look if you don't remember okay this is the formula for hypergeometric distribution right so here students if you are doing recurrence relation what you will do students you will write it write the formula as x uh, p of x plus 1 by p of x right so first you you know you know you know the formula of p of x it is uh, n factorial just now I have shown no the hypergeometric distribution formula this is p of x if it is x here here you are writing x here you are writing x uh, now if it is x plus 1 you here you will write x plus 1 and here you will write x plus 1 if you write x plus 1 here this brackets will be removed and beca this becomes minus into plus it will become minus that's why it is x n minus x minus 1 now students just substitute it, the, the those formulas here it will be this for this formula here and p, p of x formula it will be reciprocal in, in the denominator if it reciprocal the denominator part this this part comes above and this comes below right here it is above and here it is below previously it was in the denominator now students you can cancel this one and this one right you can cancel these two things now students what you will do just make it in uh, ncr form just now i have shown you and shown you m factorial by x plus 1 factorial into m minus x minus 1 factorial here it comes then uh, here n minus m factorial into uh, x uh, n minus x minus 1 factorial into n minus m minus x plus minus n plus x plus 1 right it comes here see now again this one this one you can write it as here it is x fact m factorial power x factorial into m minus x factorial it is in denominator no it is being reciprocal here it is in denominator it is m factorial in the numerator it is x factorial into x and m minus x factorial i am sure you are understanding again this one student it is here this one it is here just put a uh, line here m n minus m factorial into and this factorial n minus x factorial into n minus m minus n plus x factorial because it is minus no minus into minus plus factorial now students you can now see how what are the things you can cancel you can cancel this m factorial here and m factorial here now if i want to cancel this x factorial here in the denominator i have x plus one factorial i can extend this to x plus 1 x x minus 1 so on but i need to cancel x factorial right so what i will do i will write i will extend it to only x factorial x plus 1 factorial and x factorial i will extend it to till here then i will cancel this x factorial and this x factorial now see this m minus x minus 1 is here m minus x is here so i can extend this m minus x then again if i extend this it will become m minus x minus 1 factorial right m minus x minus 1 right 1 factorial that means i can cancel 
this part this one with the denominator one which one i can cancel this with this one now see here i have n minus m factorial here and here in the denominator i have n minus m minus 1 n minus m factorial here i have m this n minus m minus n plus x plus 1 and here it is n minus m minus so i can extend this denominator right it, if i extend this i will i will cancel this factorial part and this part that means i will get the same if i extend I will cancel this one. Okay. Now, here n minus x is there. Here n minus x minus 1 is there. So, I can extend this uh, numerator. If I extend this numerator, it will be n minus x into n minus x minus 1. Right? I will cancel that factorial and this factorial. I got all those cancelled. I am left with m minus x which is here. Then n minus x which is here. Then x plus 1 which is here and n minus m minus n plus x plus 1 which is here. Now students I can previously I had this value here. Now I am just cross multiplying to this equal to I am getting the same the same thing I am writing only with the, the same thing I am writing just multiplying this p of x here. This is what it is a recurrence relation for hypergeometric distribution. Do like, share and subscribe my video students. Okay. Thank you for listening to my lecture. Bye.